Hi, this is Miss Bublitz. I've had a couple of questions about the classification worksheet that goes along with the Brain Pop video. Remember to log into Brain Pop, you're just going to type in Benito MS and you're going to password is Benito 2020. I notice it's not case sensitive, so enter it just however you'd like. So on this worksheet, let's add these notes to it first, please. Uh, first of all, the instructions say write a greater than if the taxum on the left, this is your left hand side, is more specific than the one on the right. And I put a right for the right one. First, let's put the eight words we use in taxonomy or taxa. Let's put them in order from least specific to most specific. What I mean by most specific is those organisms share a lot of things in common with the other organisms there, okay? Nothing is more specific than species. Species, they share everything in common. They can breed together. Their offspring can go on and breed. So this is most of the animals that are normally bred. Goats breed with goats, horses with horses, and so on. So let's put domain down first. Then kingdom, phylum, class, order, family, genus, and species. All right, the video talked about dolphins, bottlenose dolphins. So the bottlenose dolphin, uh, the least specific it had was Eukarya, and then Animalia was the kingdom. Chordata was the phylum. Mammalia was the class. Guys, up until this point, that's the same as a human being, Homo sapien. We're in, we're in the same domain, we're in the same kingdom, same phylum, same class as the bottlenose dolphin because we all nurse our young and we all breathe air and we share those things in common. All right, then the dolphin got kind of more specific or most specific, and you saw the other four words they said. You notice when I wrote this right here, I put a real big capital T. Remember when I taught you this, the scientific name is always genus and species. Genus always goes first. Genus is always capitalized. Species goes last. Species is not capitalized. So I was very purposeful the way I wrote those T's, okay? Keep that in mind. So think of most specific as most things in common. That will help you. So let me get you started. Eukarya versus Animalia. Well, if you look at Eukarya, it's right here. And Animalia is right here. So Animalia must be more specific. So we're going to put the less than pointing here, just like that. Eukarya is less specific than Animalia. Next, we got, it looks like the species name is down, and they're also putting the family name. Well, species name is greater than, has this more specific than the other, so we're, this time we're going to put it like this. Okay. Next, we got chordata versus eukarya. So, chordata is right here, and eukarya is up here. So chordata, we have more things in common there, so chordata is greater. Put it like this. Mammalia versus the genus name. Genus name is obviously more specific, so we're going to put it like that. Then we have the other two words, let's use our list. It looks like chordata is further up, so it's got to be smaller, like this. And we got our two T words. And the one with the capital T first is larger, not larger, less specific, so let's put it like this. And it looks like we have they're listing the family name of a dolphin and comparing it to its order. 
So the family name is more specific, so it should go like this. And the last one is Animalia mammalia. Animalia is much further up, mammal is much further down, so it's going to have to go like that. So that should help you, okay? If you have any questions, call me, text me. I'm here. Bye.